The force of a single wave can destroy solid rock. But Laird Hamilton has spent his life harnessing the power of the planet's biggest waves. The biggest wave that I've ever been on is somewhere between 80 to 100 feet. And mean. He's now trying to catch waves never ridden before. I believe that people take on the forces of nature because that's when you feel the most alive. Laird Hamilton. For nearly 30 years, Hamilton's been cheating death and pushing the limits of the human body. When you see a big one and you choose it and get on it, everything else just ceases to exist. Born in California, he was raised in Hawaii, where at the age of seven, he met pro surfer Bob Hamilton, who would later become his stepfather. All my heroes and everybody I looked up to were all great watermen. My stepfather told me once that big wave riders are born and not made. And I think there's just something inside of us that draws us to ride these big waves that we really don't have an explanation for. Hamilton then spent his life in the ocean on a mission to surf the biggest and fastest waves on Earth. In the 90s, Laird reinvented big wave surfing and began catching potentially deadly waves, traveling at unprecedented speeds. Not believe that people take on the forces of nature because that's when you feel the most alive. You know, I, I believe that everything's possible. Having reached the limit of traditional surfing, Laird began using jet skis, allowing him to catch bigger, faster, and deadlier waves than anyone ever thought possible. The biggest wave that I've ever been on is somewhere between 80 to 100 feet, something like that, and mean. For Laird, part of the challenge is taming the beast. Hamilton, one of the few people ever to take on a wave of almost 100 feet. But he's still searching for bigger. Laird's latest quest is to find a way to surf deep water swell before it begins to break enabling him to surf faster and longer than any other surfer on Earth. At ski, no ordinary surfer can overcome the surface drag until it begins to break. So to try and tap into the swell energy, Laird Hamilton has pioneered a new board that completely redefines everything that we know about harnessing wave power. Normally when there's giant surf, the conditions are rough and you need something that can fly over those and so now we have a surfboard that has a suspension. This is a board that you're riding the fin itself actually. And the boards are virtually in the air, really the board's just more of a place to be connected to the wing. So in a sense, this is kind of where man and machine come together on the, on the water, right? Yes, I, I mean with this board and my experience, I feel like we can ride the unrideable, possibly ride the biggest waves ever ridden.